of his gear. Wants to look like Alan Iverson on the football field. It's starting 11, Kadeem Davis, uh, the problem child early, Ricardo Campbell, Kevin Graham, Kenroy Lumpen, Trevon Salmon, Alton Lewis, Javier Brown, and Jay Gale. Tyrese Harrison, he's only 19, Ricardo Messam, and the old man River, Francois Swaby, with number 16 in his back, Chris Taylor. And they'll be playing with a 4 3 3 formation. As you said, very tight at the back. Ricardo Campbell, the man of the match in their last encounter, him and Lumsden will be getting things done. But it will be Francois Swaby up front. For Mount Pleasant, the team selected by the Englishman Walter John Downs, we call him Wally, Shavin Paul, Ladiel Richie, Sule Makala, Kevin Lane, Liston James, Donovan Segree, Cleon Price makes his first appearance of Fort Mount Pleasant this season, Alwayne Harvey, Daniel Green, who's been in good form since the start of the campaign, Ricardo Morris has also taken to life well with his new club, and the babe among them, the poster boy for the Mount Pleasant Academy project, Devontae Campbell, where is number seven, Chris? Yeah, they'll be playing with a 4-4-2 formation, a nice blend of seniority and youth in this team as well. And as you said, Ricardo Morris will wear the number eight. He will certainly be a 1-0 victory. Indian Parchment starting off things. And they're united with a, a ball into the box with quality. That was a rare occasion. And that was a shot from way out by Lewis. Easily held by Shavin Sean Paul. And a glancing head as well by Lumpen. This would have been another opportunity for them. This in the second half. Messam working in. A lovely pass here by Francois Swaby to find Brown. But this pass by Brown was dismal in terms of linking back up with Swaby. was waiting at the top of the 18. And then the moment that would change it all. Lovely pass by Tyrese Gowie. And it was Harvey who actually broke out the play. Then that pass, one time back heel into the path of Kesslon Hall and the long time Mount Pleasant servant finishing into the far corner seven goals on the season for Mount Pleasant Kesslon Hall's first and it proved to be the winner then this moment which nearly cost Veer United another goal sloppy by Davis Kesslon Hall did excellent to set up Gowie on this occasion so the reverse but Gowie didn't have the composure to finish and that was from five yards in. So 1-0 after 90. There we have a look at the statistics of three shots on target from six attempts for Vera United. They lacked potency up front. Five on target from 14 for Mount Pleasant. 22 fouls and Daniel Parchment was very busy issuing four yellow cards, two to each. And as we see, two offsides, three corners for each of the teams, two saves for both keepers. And majority of the possession for Mount Pleasant with 57%. And they take all three points. And three from three for the start of the season. They defeat Vera United by a goal to nil. Let's hear from our man of the match, goal scorer, Kesslan Hall. 